Hey guys, it's Nina Saul with Spiritual Vibes. I just wanted to do this quick video to show you guys a process of me making one of my pieces. Um, you guys might not see the finished, uh, the finished product of this because this is going to be a very personal um, altar. Uh, matter of fact, I'm not even going to show you guys what um, it is that I'm putting in here because these white things are actually, um, they're actually photos. So, um, they're very personal. So I just wanted to kind of show you guys, um, like the pictures that I put inside of pieces. Um, this is going to be an altar. So, um, the pictures that I'm putting inside, I actually have to, um, they have to go through a process themselves before even being able to get put inside of the altar. And when I do it, I have to do it very slow. Um, very slow and careful because... I have to push the photo. I basically I'm working backwards um, when I'm doing these um, pieces. When they're more, uh, these are more more complex pieces. So I don't make a whole lot of them. But for um, serious major things, or if somebody wants. Um, pictures of certain people or deities inside of their pieces this is the process that I have to go through to create each piece so you can kind of see all these little air bubbles like all over here right um, so I'm just gonna show you guys oh, real quick you see how they go away I literally have to pop all these air bubbles, otherwise it's not going to be very clear and you would not be able to see what, you would not be able to see the image, um, you would just see a bunch of bubbles. So this is part of what it is that I do and I yes I actually do have to wear a mask and everything while doing this because this is uh, actually really dangerous stuff it's not good for you to breathe this stuff in so um, basically the front part of this is going to be a grid that I created and like I said I'm not really going to tell you guys too much unless um, the person says or gives me permission to be able to show it, but I highly doubt it because there are very personal things inside of here. Um, there's going to be even more personal things going inside of it. So, um, this was just kind of me showing you guys like the process of uh, what I do and how I do it and how it's not so easy so it does take me a while to get orders done but this is why I literally have to go layer by layer by layer and each layer is I'm sorry you guys I'm downstairs in my work area so you probably hear a bunch of stuff going on upstairs um I'm working from home today so uh, especially because the stuff that I make not all the stuff that I make can be made at the shop uh, because these are chemicals that are mixed together and it creates a reaction that is not good for people to be breathing in. Um, so, like I had said, my, my organites are different than the ones that are out there on the market. The reason being is because I am a practitioner. So everything that I use, um, you know, like right here, these are bobcat claws and they go all around. So these are bobcat claws and, uh, you know, like my, my organites are different because I actually do, it's, it's pretty much an encased working on its own, um, a spell on its own. 
each piece is because I use the crystals, I create a grid. Um, I do all of everything that I do is through um, the intentions that I'm asked to put in each piece. And it's um, also being created by me uh, calling upon my spirit guides to guide me and to tell me what it is that I'm supposed to do because you guys let me know what it is that you would like the piece to be for, what intentions you would like. And then from there, I take it from there and then spirit takes it the rest of the way. So that's it, you guys. And I'm sorry if I sound like I'm like, muffled it's because I'm wearing a mask um well I am going to get back to work and I just wanted to quick show you guys uh the little piece of the process that I do so um most likely this piece will not be shared when it's finished and it sucks because it's going to be amazing but um yeah I, I guess we'll see what happens all right you guys I'll see you later I'll see you at the next video and I hope everyone is having a good evening, and I will see you guys next time. Blessed be.